a lot of people don't pronate on the serve or they do very little pronation, you know, if any at all. And it's the main reason why a lot of players will never have a powerful serve. So what we need to understand about pronation is that it's a turning over of our shoulder. Okay, it's an internal rotation and it happens after we hit the ball. So what happens is we start flipping our shoulder from the racket drop, which is back here. As we drive the ax, we start to twist out to about 90 degrees until our strings are parallel with the service box. And then after we hit the ball, instead of just going down back to our left side for a right-handed player, we keep going up and out to the right to get this extra range of motion and increase our racket head speed by twisting out the racket another 90 degrees. The major checkpoints when doing this movement are after contact point, after you've thrown the ax and flipped the racket 90 degrees by turning over your entire arm. Okay, think about it like a rolling log moving as a unit. Boom, you wanna feel like you check the time on your imaginary watch. Okay, that doesn't mean you feel like you're just twisting out your wrist, it's the entire arm going out together, okay? Now, this is going to increase power and racket head speed, but more importantly, spin on your serve. And it's very hard to generate any spin on your serve if you don't pronate and go through the ball and twist out. This is especially important on the second serve, right, our top spin serve, where we actually stay more sideways at contact and we want to hyper pronate along the baseline. Think about it like this. We pronate on the ground strokes as well, okay? Specifically the forehand, where after we hit, it's very important that we cover the ball with a windshield wiper or else we're not gonna get any spin. The tennis ball doesn't know if it's being hit by a forehand, a backhand, or a serve. So if we wanna get top spin and racket head speed on our serve, the mechanics are the exact same, okay? Obviously, it's just happening, you know, in a different plane because the ball's not down here, it's up here. So that's why we pronate, okay? Or else our serve will never have any spin. Hey, you can now read my book, Tennis Doctor, Modern Tennis, Step-by-Step, Step, and it's a tennis self-help book for adults. You can now buy it on Amazon. It's available everywhere, paperback, hardcover, and Kindle. Uh, this is the proof copy. I don't even have a physical copy yet. It literally just came out today, so. I'm waiting on that and uh, be the first to read it, okay?